What's up guys, Tinman77 here with another YouTube video. Today we're going to talk about why Karfus bot is the best bot laner together with Bard, coming from a Grandmaster Bard player. Uh, I made a list because there's a lot of reason. In the 2v2 you have a very good trade pattern with Bard. He can hit the Q through the minions, stun them and you just throw a Q. And you have really good poke on them without having to engage into the fight. You also have a really good all-in, which is weird because usually the combos are either good in all-in or good poke, but they don't have both. So you can poke them and also all-in. You also got a lot of slows, Bard meeps, Bard Q, the Carfus wall. You can always chase enemies down. You also have a really good level 1. Bard has one of the strongest level 1s in the game. Because he basically has one extra ability with his passive, and if enemies play too aggressive, Corfus with his Qs and Bard with his Q and the auto attacks, you can just kill them. A lot of damage level 1. The main reason why it's such a good combo is not the 2v2 though, it's because how Corfus is alone in the lane. As Bard, you want to be roaming. But with certain ADCs, they just keep you glued to the bot lane, like Caitlyn. You don't really want to weak side a Caitlyn, she needs to be strong. So, when Bard is roaming, Karthus can farm pretty safely with Q from longer range, you know. Another ADC would have to go way closer to the minions to get it. And Karthus can just get it like this. Also, it's really hard to die if Karthus, even 3v1, he will get one or two people. One of the main issues is when you're roaming, enemy support is not roaming, and enemy jungle is bot, your ADC will get dove, you will lose a lot of minions, a lot of experience, and it's really bad that even if you kill top lane in a dive, it's basically even, but with Karthus, you just can't dive him, he just will kill one or two people. He also has very good wave clear, so if enemies shove in the wave and reset, you can just one shot the next wave and then also reset. He has no trouble pushing out the lane alone. Another reason why it's such a good combo is when you're roaming and enemy support doesn't roam, you're basically at a 4v3 top lane and with Karthus ult which has a lot of impact on the map, it's basically a 5v3 and it's unlosable almost. That's pretty much it why he's my favorite ADC together with Ezreal to play with as Bard. If you have a Karthus ADC, you want max one other AP damage in the team. Preferably he's the only AP damage, because he has enough AP damage. Because he hits every every enemy with the ult, which obviously deals a lot of damage. Thank you for tuning in. If you want to see more videos like this on specific champions, let me know. Thanks for watching.